We started off with our pre-qualification process and that was that the, uh, the results of that were announced in the beginning of last year and we pre-qualified pre three groups who were going to compete for the project, three world-class organisations and we've been working with each of those over the last 18 months which um, culminated in them offering us their final bids at the end of last year and since then we've been evaluating those bids uh, to a point where we can now announce uh, the best offer and uh, Mersey Link have provided that offer to the council. Our consortium are uh, really pleased with it all and it allows us on this iconic project uh, which is a major cable stay bridge and free flow tolling uh, system, uh, an upgrade of all of the, uh, the regional roads, allows us to show off our skills and expertise basically because we've got market leaders in, uh, in construction, uh, finance and tolling uh, that, uh, that contributed towards this uh, from around the world. Yeah, to deliver value for money, um, it's important that you try and present the project to the market in the best possible form to enable them to have some scope to innovate and to bring to bear the efficiencies that they can offer in terms of managing the significant risks in a project like this. But then, as well as that, we've got an investment arm which is uh, from Macquarie Capital, Billfinger Project Investments and Vialia, which is part of FCC, that have brought together the commercial and financial arrangements and brought in a very competitive uh, and effective uh, financing solution and legal uh, solution. Lastly, but definitely not least, is, uh, is the tolling operator. Uh, we brought in Sanef, who are a French tolling operator. They've got more uh, free flow tolling experience than virtually anybody else in the world and can bring all of that expertise together to, uh, to make sure that this bridge and its, uh, its financing will work effectively. What happens next is that we, uh, we then have to go through a financial close process, which will be a few months yet. Uh, it's probably going to be up until November, December time of this year to bring all the finance together that we've proposed, to bring the banks and uh, the bond uh, that, we, that we set up with the project, and then negotiate all the legal uh, documents. The issue now is that we can say with confidence that the savings are in the order of tens of millions and, and we will not require all the grant that we, the maximum grant we agree with the government, so it's coming on the budget.